Hi everyone, thanks for joining me. I've had a few requests to see what's inside this Kate Spade inspired loaded envelope and I'm excited to tell you I'm going to give this envelope away to one of my YouTube subscribers. So stay tuned to the end of the video and find out how you can enter to win. So let's jump right in. This is the front of course and before I open it up, this is the back. This has been foiled with deco foil as well as this. I don't know if you can see the shine. Okay, so I'm just going to start with this front pocket. I just used a toothpick star. These were in the taller <laughs> Target dollar spot. Here are some Heidi Swap pieces of ephemera. They're a few years old. This is a shaker tag. I have a clear acetate piece inside and then I fused it and added some really cute striped sequins, some pink sequins, kind of went with my theme. Just a super simple tag. And that's all that's in the front pocket. Next we have, besides our chenille sticks, we have just some, a little clip that I made. I just glued a pom-pom on top of a little clothespin. And this includes a little mixture of those sequins. Here are some Project Life cards that kind of went with the theme. And I just had all those stuck together with that pom-pom paper clip. Super simple. This is a package of ephemera and this has some flare in it that also goes with my theme, just some pink pieces of flare. These are two thread cards. One I put some twine, the other is some white and black washi tape. This is a Heidi Swap paper clip. Here is another piece of ephemera, eat cake for breakfast. And another one of those thread cards with some washi tape. This doily is adhered down. This is just a stick that was in the Target dollar spot as well. Got a little bit of glue and then I, it had gold on it and I wanted to put silver so I just took a little bit of this bead and just hot glued it around the stem. And I made this paper clip. It's just a bow with some of that beading and a little heart on the back. So that's it for the inside of the front pockets. Oh, this is just a little binder clip and I put a little white pom-pom, a little um, tassel, and just a piece of this beaded sequined thread. Okay, on the inside, this is a super large tag and I thought I would write my note on the back. Uh, this was a, I didn't draw this, this was a gift in one of my swap bags and forgive me, I can't remember who I got that from, but I thought that was really cool. This is just some page flags, or I mean, I'm sorry, cupcake flags that were also in the Target dollar spot, as well as some puppy hearts. These are just some, um, I have a ton of those roller stamps that say words on them. So I just stamped them, cut them out, and just include those in a baggie. I thought somebody could use those for some, <clears throat> for some ephemera, excuse me. This is some um, die cut pieces to make bows. a fun straw. This is a, this was also a note card that I received in a swap and I just turned it into a tea bag holder. It matched my theme. This is some paper clips that I made. These are from the Target dollar spot, um, the puppy hearts. These are also from the Target dollar spot as well as that little owl. I thought those turned out really cute. 
So super easy stuff. Here are just some Valentine's stickers and some uh, foil letter stickers. Also inside, this is a, I made a Kate Spade post-it note holder. And I just made that matchbook style. And these are some page flags that I've had in my stash since, I don't know, sometime earlier this year. Those were from the Target, Target dollar spot. And that's it for the front and inside. Now we flip over to the back. I made some Kate Spade flare, which I thought turned out really cute. Sorry for the glare. This is just an envelope full of some cute color coordinating die cuts that went with my theme. And I threw one of those eat cake for breakfast in there. The recipient can use those. And just two matching doilies or coordinating doilies. One has black polka dots and the other is just plain pink. This is just a piece of bling that I cut off and hot glued. It goes all the way around to the front. And I just added a piece of flare right there. Thanks so much for watching. I'm giving this bag away to one of my YouTube followers and all you have to do is be subscribed to this channel and leave a comment below and I will be announcing a winner soon. Thanks so much for watching. See ya. Bye.